Are you concerned? Hello, welcome back to my channel. So, you might be concerned, like I, I said. And, yeah, because I have a plate with flour, a knife, and a spoon. And I just need one more thing. And an apple in a bag. So, you know how I was talking about my banana, like, two videos ago? Because the last video was my Roblox hobby, which I haven't filmed yet, so it doesn't feel like the last video. But the one, the Halloween vlog, I talked about that banana. And my actual video where I, like, prank people with a banana, like that one. Well, I was eating lunch, and I didn't have time to eat this apple. So I'm like, hmm, what, what, what if instead I, like, decide to stick a knife in and like carve most of it out so I'm like gonna keep the skin I'll even keep the sticker on it so people think it's believable but then I fill it with flour and then give it to someone and see how they react <laughs> I don't know where should we cut it out so like at the bottom but people look at the bottom like somewhat close to the bottom it's like doo -doo -doo -doo. I don't know what I'm doing okay Ooh, I made a slice okay we can like cut out a little area now here's the really tricky part. See, I cut the like the outline, but now I kind of need to get it out. So we're gonna try to angle the knife. Mm. This is oh yes. See now we have a hole, and this hole is important because we're gonna do everything with this hole. I should have probably had a bigger one that I can actually get a spoon through because <laughs> actually the end of the spoon could work. See, I'll just kind of stick my spoon in here. And we'll try to get as much out as possible. So it's kind of like carving a pumpkin, you know? But afterwards, I'm just going to fill it with flour. Oh, I see a seed. Can you see it? Yeah, you can. So I just finished Lost Season 2. Because I talked about it in my Halloween vlog. Like, yeah, I'm going to finish the episode. I never did. But I did a couple of days ago, I think. And now I'm starting the third season. Which has been pretty good so far. Yeah, and I'm glad because Desmond's back. Actually, I shouldn't spoil anything, sorry. But, like, yeah, Desmond gets back in the third season or end of second. I don't know. Okay, I think my baking and pastry teacher kind of hates me because, well, we were making key lime pie. And it was, like, add two cans of whatever the thing was. It was, like, really thick. It kind of looked like pudding, but I don't think it actually was pudding. And then right next to it two and then it was like 14 ounces and then I got confused I thought two combined equals 14 ounces but no that's just one can so then I only added one can because I looked at the thing and I'm like oh this is 14 ounces she must have got like the double size yeah I needed both of the cans so she docked points for that once time in the one of the units we made um pumpkin bread I don't know if I told the story but we took it out of the oven and someone poked it and it's like, oh, it's fine. So then we let it sit and then we poured the frosting on top of it. And then we, it like sinks into the cake or whatever, the bars. I don't know. And then we're like, what the heck is that? And it's like, oh, it's not done yet. So then we put it back in the other. And then the frosting is still on top of it, all the frosting. And it like boils and it's like a weird mush. And like only out, the outsides are kind of done. And she only knocked off a half a point. But she already knocked off four points two days ago from me, my thing for task distribution and I'm like what the heck you're all doing something you should have knocked me down points last year I barely did anything plus she got mad at me for cutting the pot for the pie being in nine pieces instead of ten but like cutting into ten pieces is kind of confusing don't you think like normally it's eight or maybe twelve but ten you're like have to cut into like that sounds really confusing and so the person that was cutting probably messed up and then made nine accidentally but she's like yelling at me for it like i wasn't even the one that cut it wait i've done carving it wait where's the camera thing Ooh, tilt it so you can see all the angles okay but anyway we got it mostly carved so yeah, i don't want to accidentally try to break the outside because that'd be bad so we're gonna clean the outside a little bit Make sure it's nice and open. Well, I don't know what I'm doing. You gotta be sanitary. Okay, I've got the flour. Let's really hope I don't make a mess. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just spilling. What am I doing? That 
I've got like no flour in there. And I'm making a mess. Now that we've got this, it'll be a much easier process. Just to go like, oh, there's a little clump. Plop the little clump in. Okay, good, good, good. It's like totally full now. Now this is becoming more and more like a trim, trim plank every minute. Okay, I was lucky and we do have like green apples. Well, technically, I think they're my sisters, but like, really, look at the texture of this. Focus. You can't really tell, but that does not look like an apple. Okay, but we're just gonna try to take the skin from this. Does that look suspicious? <laughs> Pepper, I swear, do not knock that down. <gasps> She's tipping the table. Pepper, I need you to stop. This is not a good idea for a kitty to be here. Surgically put him all back up. Ooh. Does this look natural? <laughs> Maybe I need a paint apple. Maybe I could say it's a caramel apple. <gasps> How do you make caramel? I could make a dip it in caramel apple and give it to somebody. No one will ever know. Oh my god, I'm so smart. Okay, so I made the up the frost thing because I figured that would be kind of boring. And I actually made it right this time. It's not really runny. And so we got our apple. And I figured if I'm doing this, I should not have this piece in here. Because there's hot glue in it and I don't want someone to accidentally eat hot glue. So now, shoot, <laughs> I forgot about that. We still have to like close this hole a little, a little bit. Do I still have that up? No, I don't. Okay, maybe we'll just fill it with frosting first. So you're just going to get the frosting all around. Okay, now is the time to put in the sprinkles. Ooh, I don't know how well this will go. Oh, it's just taking off all the frosting. Oh, this sucks. Okay, I'm just gonna pour sprinkles on it. Um, okay, I'm gonna put this in the freezer and I'll talk to you later once it's done. No, maybe the, just the fridge. I wonder what's inside this fridge. <gasps> Ooh. Is this a candy apple for me? Mmm. that was that how y'all like that so my sister tried it and <laughs> yeah um she kind of made a mess out of everything as you ah, may tell there's flour everywhere on the plate probably duh because this thing is full of flour Ugh, it's so messy but yeah i'm like this is not gonna get to school a this thing this thing i put in there wasn't sticking and <laughs> Nobody's going to try, like, if I actually give this to my friend, no one would get a vase in it. They would have probably just thrown it away. So, I'm like, well, this, this has a cool little montage feature, which took way too long to film. Maybe next week, I'll just post that. <gasps> I could do, like, a bloopers reel, but that's just, like, the whole thing? Wait. This is pretty fun assignment. Um, whatever the heck this is. I mean, the frosting actually tastes good. Should I try it? Okay, it tastes weird kind of, it kind of tastes weird now. Um, yeah, that it doesn't taste good anymore. Um, that might have had flour on it, so. Yeah, but this is like a fun prank to do. Yeah, you just need basically just an apple, a spoon, a knife. Um, oh, frosting ingredients, so powdered sugar and milk. And then a popsicle stick. And you can use sprinkles if you want. I'm gonna take a bite. Okay. Oh. Look. Here's, this piece has frosting, flour, and apple on it. <laughs> it's not that bad. Really is it? Ta-da! So you better smash that thumbs up button. Smash the 
subscribe button. And I'll see y'all next week.